Hello all, Havoc here. Alright, so we're going to start this episode off by calling in a vendor. Um, I'm kind of scared too because we're low on money and I'm afraid of missing an opportunity. But, yeah. Uh, comments from last episode. Uh, actually, comments from episode before last. Uh, missed the comment about... It ended up coming, the comment coming in for 20 episodes about making sure to put 20 to 30 heaters down. And I think I'm going to be pretty close to that. So I'm looking forward to it. So let's see here. We need a screwdriver. But uh, yeah, we're going to do like three rows of pipes. So. So 57 right there. So that one's pretty close. By the way. Sixty-nine, seventy-three. That's it. Seventy-three. That's gonna go down. It's actually not changing at all. So there we go. So let's do that. And again, it should put us right there. Money. Oh, if he has something I want, I'm going to be super bummed out. I mean, I'll sell backpacks and stuff for some of the higher tier cool stuff, right? Door kit, kit engine large. Oh, basic mining drill. All right. Well. Door controller, canister storage, engine processor. Nope, nothing. Nothing we need. That that could have been the one. All right. So let's bring this down. Oop. Seven. I'm looking at the sixty-seven percent. That was right there. Okay. So we need to bring it a sky around. The wrong way. One more. That'll be butter. Ah! Oh. Whoops. I'm doing it again. Oh, we're chasing him. What's going on? He's moving. He's moving. Get him, get him, get him. Quick, he's on the move. Oh, great. <laughs> uh, yeah, I caught that, it, by the way, it, towards the end of the episode yesterday, that yes, you can make khaki paint. So, and there it is, khaki paint. Get out of here. <laughs> we'll call in one more. And he's pretty much pointed straight out there, so let's bring it around. Uh, there's a couple new unknowns. All right, so 80, 90. Ah, too far. Bring it back. Another Exotech, okay. This is the guy that makes me nervous. This is the guy I think has the goods I want. Uh, computer kit battery. Okay, I think that's the one we've been getting from another stellar anchor and a basic mining drill again. Okay, well, how much is a mining drill? It's 2300 I really thought about getting that uh, other engine, but that would have broke. That would have been that would have been it. And then all we had. What do you say? One more. All 
All right. Oh, there's one. Right at the end. Well, he's obviously on the move because, oh, no, the dish moved. Okay. I thought the dish had stopped him. Ah! Uh. <sighs> okay. Whew, that was close. Nope, too far. Right there. All right, so now, wrong way. What? Oh, come on. Yeah, there's 90. There it is. Almost 100%. Hulk Corp security. That's what I'm not too worried about. This is going to be security cards and shenanigans. Alright, but... Ah, oh, you bugged out on me. Really? Yeah, I'd be sad too looking down at your data pad. It's fine. Get out of here. Are we going to make the rail? Nope. Going to make the ground. Alright, so we're going to need to do a loot run here pretty soon. And I think we're going to take the Mark 1 out. Like I said, I'm a lot more impressed with this guy. So, but today, we're going to get some panels done. We're going to get some walls put up in here. Got the lights done. That's just turned out stunning. Really like it. But I want to get some paneling done, and I'm not sure which one I want to use. I know we're going to paint them. I need to figure out which one we want to do. So flat wall. Um, yeah, that's that's definitely an option. Now let's get this stuff put away. Actually, a couple extra battery chargers. T for, totally had forgotten about that. Hmm. All right. Uh, let's do this. Steel, iron, plastic, and glass. That should work. Still need to work on getting all this inventory properly moved around. Passive events, active events. Yeah, that's the kind of stuff I'm talking about. Padded wall, iron wall, flat wall. All right, so we're gonna need some red ones anyway, so we're gonna do that way. So I'm pretty sure flat wall is what I want to go with. Flat wall, corner trim, triangular, square, panel two tone. Let's take a look at this bad boy. See what it looks like. So I'm going to put it over here. And let's throw some uh, steel plate at it and see what it looks like. Not liking it. Okay, so not that one. OK, 
Okay, so not two-tone. Small panel monochrome. Small panel with arrows, with a hatch. Wall plating. I think this is the, this is the one. Yeah, we're just gonna go with the standard. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. I don't like the two-tone, so. So you go back here. That's not what I wanted to do. Great. So we need to come out three panels. No. Yeah. Might have to move the rover. Yeah, I'll count out three panels. Okay. Oh, those are already there. Ha <laughs> ha! Remodeling the garage might be a good idea to get the vehicles out of the garage. <laughs> Scratching dents are coming. Crikey. Yeah, the little guy has got a lot more pep in his step. Come on, really? All right. I'll leave that one in as character, I guess. <laughs> All right, so then we're going to do two stripes of orange, two stripes of yellow, and then two stripes of gray. Yeah, that'll work. So we need some orange and yellow paint. Okay, so... What color are you? Because if this is, that looks white, so we'll go with that because it's already that color. Need to get the floor cleaned out too. Uh, so much work to do. Let's do this side first. That's a large panel. It's not what I, I'm going to do the large panel here, as long as the color's good. That's white. Very bright. All right. And then we'll do yellow, orange, and then red. Definitely like the idea of the stripes. Definitely like the idea of knowing where we put all our spray paint. All right. We put it up here. No, no, and no. Orange, oranger.
And yellow. Freeloader sitting there just chewing energy off of our pad. All right, orange is next. So we're going to do the large panels all the way out. All right, and then we're going to do yellow on this one. I'm going to go grab a couple more. Be nice if there's some right here. Ah, there are. Yeah, buddy, that was convenient. Almost like I planned it. Nope, I didn't. All right, so that is that. Now we just get these guys. Done. There we go. Oh my goodness. Button is so hard to hit. I was saying, I saw on forums where they were talking about changes to this rover. And the most common request was to change the size of that button. Orange and red. Stop. Yeah. Oh my goodness. There we go. Nice. I like how uneven I'm parking. That's better. Yeah. It's like you can't click on the button. You have to click on just the edge of the bezel of the button. It's pretty crazy. Uh, we need a light back here too. But those colored panels, superb concept. I appreciate you guys is bringing comments like that to it. It took a minute to get there, but. I'm just ripping around in it right now. Oop, totally missed by doing that too. I mean, you can't see anything behind you. That should be good. I mean, this guy, we could totally just bring it in and parallel park it wherever we wanted. But, um, yeah. Some type of like rotating mechanism, that'd be kind of cool. Just park it on a carousel, just drive it in, rotate it around, drive it back out. That'd be pretty sweet. All right. So we need some more lights in here. We need to get some more paneling in here. I think we're gonna go to 
red, full panels, those panels, all the way back. Everything else is red, right? So I'll need some more steel plate, which, well, that we're good on. And flat wall. That's not what I intended to do. Intended to do that, but that's fine. So now we need some lights. Back here somewhere. Why? Oh, there's already one there. Nope. Yes. Oh yeah, it's coming together. I have a feeling that's the wrong panel. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely the wrong panel. All right. I don't know. These need, almost need to go. They should almost go to the five panel. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Stick with the uh, small panel or do we go to the large panel? Kind of torn. But this has got to go. Actually, that goes back. This comes out. There we go. That doesn't look too bad. I like the, how that looks. Let me get some more in there, actually. There. It's looking pretty good. But lights, 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 lights. I think next we need um, some more grating to bring out this way, and we can put lights in there, I think. I don't think we have any more. Need to go check. We had them, pretty much all of them are over here. Oh, we do have some. Sweet. Let's see if we can place them there. And if so, we're going to try to get some lights up in there, too. Yes. I don't know why I didn't put these in sooner. Um, maybe I was thinking that I was going to be able to, and that's why I did the uh, the ones across right there. Yeah. All right, so then we'll bring this light back that way. All right, we're good. Go down, drop those lights in. Go here, you go here. Long wide to here. Perfect. It's not the same spacing as the rest of the bay, but it's going to work. OK, 
Okay. Put up our electrical belt. All right, so. Stop from crossing the streams. There we go. And just straight from there. B-U-T, miss. Hey, hey! The entire vehicle base lit up. Get this all put away now. That Probably. No, I can't change that. Not from here. Um, hmm. What I could do is bring it over. Wait, where does that actually go? Because if I bring it up in the corner of the wall, the two wall panels will hide it. I'd have to come up over here to do that. All right, so that's something I have to look at doing here pretty soon because I don't really don't. Uh, everything else is pretty clean. We do have that chute coming through, but I can't. That I can't hide. I'd have to build another wall. I could do another step, like put a wall coming down and then over. But I really like the way this looks. It's large, it's open. Yeah, I like the way this works. I think we should put another guardrail here too. So you come all the way over to here and then come out into the vehicle bay part. Put some more lockers in. We need some lights. We have lights underneath on that side, but it's so high up and it's just a catwalk. But I think we're going to do lights out here. It's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. Something like... We're doing the angled ones. Which one are you? That was it. Angled. Just facing downward. And we're on the third rung up right there. Why aren't you letting me place that there? Placement blocked by heavy cable straight. Alright, so there's obviously something up in there that's making that a mess. All the things I want to do are blocked by something simple. Story of my life. Oh yeah, I ran it right down the edge. Alright, well... We'd have to change this. So we have a power breakout. So what we could do is cable drops down up into the light, into the light. So yeah, we'd have to bring down the cable, come back up and then do it again. Actually just bring the cable down don't even worry about bringing it back up. Just run it across the bottom. And then we can put our light where we want. All right. So lighting is starting to become more of a concern, which is great because it means we're making progress with everything else, right? We're making some huge leaps. 
I think next episode we're going to tackle this guy so we can start getting into some of the more complex metals. Specifically, I want to get into steel, but um, it means a lot of insulated pipe, which means we need silicon, which means I'm actually going to have to go mining. I haven't really done a lot of mining, so this is going to be interesting. So, a little quick search up here. I'd like to upgrade this guy too. That'd be kind of nice. Pipe, insulated. Yeah, we need steel and silicon. So, progress is being made though. So, we need the mining drill heavy. That's one of the ones we want to get. Steel, electron. Invar and solder. Electrum and invar. Electrum? Nope. Invar. Okay, we got invar. He's got all our solder. You have the solder, invar, electron, steel. We could do the heavy right now. Let's do it. Let's do it. Can we make it? Yes. The big heavy mining drill. I'm super excited. Yeah, buddy. Actually, we can make two of these things. I'm <laughs> oh, yeah. And then our other mining drill with a battery is going to go into our backup bag. Oh, uh, yeah. So you're going to go into our backup bag now. <laughs> like though the switch is like nowhere near where our hand is right now. That's funny. All right, so marine suit armor. That's what you guys were telling me that I could put here instead of the suit, or uh, instead of a uniform. How much does it cost to make? Oh, I have those, don't I? I've got tons of them. I'm not gonna craft that. Never mind. But yeah, that's what you guys were telling me I need to put here to help protect my uniform. We will go do that here in a second. So let's kind of just browse through here. The dirt canister. That's so we can fill back in, right? Oh, terrain manipulator. Okay, there we go. Basketball hoop, igniter, flags, food, labeler, angle grinder. Now, does this faster? Or the Mark II? I was always told that the Mark IIs were just higher temperature tolerances compared to these, so they don't melt on really crazy planets but if the mark ii stuff's better let me know in the comments below is it actually worth spending the resources to get all right i think we're doing pretty good now wait let's go run and do that real quick with the uh the uniform because we got so many of these things i didn't even realize that this was a thing, guys. And a ton of errors. Whoa, hold on. Hold on. I can't get to... Is it four? Five. Ugh, I can't get... Oh, it's three. Why? Why? What are we doing? What is going on here? Get that back. What have I done? Holy cow. Alright, so with this guy, there's no atmospherics and stuff. So I have no idea why I was going bonkers like that.
Okay. So, yep, there it goes again. Atmospheric objects, not instance of an object. Okay. Well, so that scratches that idea. That's a great idea as a whole, but I mean, I could just do this, right? So then I can come in here, AC off. So even if I do that, they still sit there and complain. So I can do that. I'll get rid of one of them. Does it come back when I take that out? Yeah. Filtering everything off. Yeah, no. Not gonna. I'm not gonna deal with that constantly. Like, nope. Not gonna happen. When we don't need it. I mean, there's, there's, there's no point. Well, I try, guys. Appreciate all the help you guys bring to the channel. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Keep YouTube happy and keep spreading the uh, videos that I keep creating. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.